I started teaching and I realized I had this muscle that I didn't know I had. Because I really, and I still don't have what I perceive that a lot of acting teachers do have. And I think it's because I come from the art form from the inside out. Because all I wanted to do was act. And when I started teaching, I realized I knew things that I could not have learned if I decided to be a teacher. So it was really interesting. And now, that was 20 years ago. And now what I believe is I provide the space and give people exercises, and they don't know what I'm doing. And they think, what is this? And how is it related to acting? And then they have an experience of themselves that then they use in their work. And so I, I believe that this philosophy I have about teaching is that you can't teach. As soon as you start talking about acting, it, it doesn't make any sense. In, and all creativity, I think, is available to be used. But if you start telling people what to do, then they leave themselves out. So these exercises that I do help people find who they really are and how to tell the truth via a piece of text. Because really, if you're not bringing the text to life, you're not acting. Acting is not, it's an art form that few people understand. You can't read about it and do it. You can't talk about it and do it. And it's an art form that needs people. So you have to practice it, like an athlete or a, vi a person who plays the violin. So if you, don't, if you don't develop your insides, that's what you have to offer your acting, is developing your insides. 